financial experts say you should apply online at the FAFSA website and apply early. That will give you the best chance of getting money for the upcoming school year. The state deadline for Indiana was back in April, but that only applied if you were seeking state financial aid. The FAFSA form is used to determine eligibility for both state and federal money. If you're hoping to get a federal Pell Grant or other types of financial aid, make sure you fill out the FAFSA form by June 30th. We talk with an Indianapolis financial advisor with UBS who says many middle class families may qualify for financial aid and not even know it. Scott Metzinger says many Hoosiers don't save enough for college and start too late, but he is seeing some encouraging trends. One of the trends we're seeing is that people are actually establishing college 529 plans, and then they're encouraging friends and families to contribute or gift into those 529 plans. So you think about a birthday party. Um, your child, instead of giving them a $100 gift, maybe have the grandparents send $50 of that directly into gifting into the 529 plan and spend the other $50 on the toy. But that way they're investing in the child's future. About two-thirds of full-time students pay for college with the help of financial aid, either through grants or or scholarships. The state says students should look into all of their financial options. Many colleges and universities offer financial aid and scholarships as well as nonprofits. Kara Kenny, RTV6.